Good evening, everyone. Welcome back to Dot Hack GU. Project GU leader? What? Has Yada completely lost his mind? Rebirth. Yeah, so there's a forum posting from someone anonymous saying, Yo, I'm the leader of Project GU, Triedge. Come meet me here in Delta Hidden Forbidden Holy Ground. I guess I better go to the Hulgrans Cathedral at Delta Hidden Forbidden Holy Ground. That. That place right there. So we can, I think, keep grinding through the arena, or we could go do other stuff, level up, that sort of thing. But no, we're gonna go back to Makanu. I probably... I don't know if it matters if I take people or not. I don't know if it'll let me, actually. Are people even on? Nope, they're all offline or busy or whatever. So we're just gonna go. We're gonna go to Hidden Forbidden Holy Ground. This is where Sheena was PK'd. This is where we ran into Triage and got our level reset. This is it. This is where the Aura statue is. Or was. This is where Kite fought his first data bug. Back in R1. I always like this area. It's always one of my favorites. This place has some really, really cool lost grounds. Oh, and it has music, too. Alright, let's go see if Triad showed up. Haseo, now that your level's been reset, I'm sure you're much better equipped for fighting a notorious PKer who shut you down when you were, you know, level 150 million or whatever you were. What could possibly go wrong? Also, we get to meet my favorite character in the game. My favorite character in the franchise. Nice. I see that you have fallen straight into my trap, Triedge. I have finally found you. Come and become bound as you deserve. Who... who are you? Ha! You pathetic human beings are not worthy enough to know what my name is. <laughs> Slow Doberman! Heroes! At your service! Ta -da! You just told me. Oh. Also, I better tell you that you've got the wrong guy. I am not Triage. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Please accept my apologies. I had truly thought that you, sir, were Triage. So tell me, why are you looking for him? Hmm, well, listen to this. I have a completely hypothetical story for you. Imagine, if you will, a graphic designer at a certain game company. And that that man possessed the greatest confidence in his graphical creations. He logged into his company's game to experience his creations in their native environment. Mm -hmm. But one day he saw something he couldn't believe right before his very eyes. His super amazing, ultra incredibly cool graphics that he slaved over for many waking hours had been all etched up with these hideous triangular monstrosities. What blasphemy, what lunacy. Now, having transformed into a demon fueled by the fires of revenge, this hypothetical man used the forums to lay an impeccable trap, a foolproof plan for the culprit. Is that story really hypothetical? Of course it is. I said that it was, didn't I? Anyway, you're no match for Triage. Stop chasing him for your own sake. Don't try to dissuade me! I'm never going to stop until I can find a way to trap him! So I guess you're looking for Triage too. Yeah. Hmm. Hey, could you please tell me if you find any more areas with Triage signs in them? Hmm. Although you are dressed in some of the deepest black known to man, looking at you, I believe I do detect a little glimmer of justice deep inside your eyes. Very well, he of fair eyes. It would appear that you and I are partners in our quest to find Triage. Huh? I accept you as a fellow hunter of Triage and pledge to fight by your side until my life gives out. What? 
<laughs> oh, Pyrrhos, never change. Well, whatever. So, what's this about you being Project GU's leader? So, you also wish to enter my guild, huh? Uh, it is not easy to join me, since the condition is you must be able to draw. After all, GU stands for Graphics Unbelievable. So, do you know anyone named Yada? No, who's that? Forget it. Never mind. Okay. Well then, I'm off to formulate another plan. May the stars shine down upon you until you arrive at the end of your journey. I'm off! I feel like I just shaved ten years off of my life. Guess I'll head back to town. Oh, Pyrrhos. <laughs> hey, look at that! Pyrrhos can come fight in arena battles with us. Oh, let's go do that. Also, I love that, like, the chains are just broken and laying around where the aura statue used to be. That's so cool! Ah! Uh, can we... Wait, there we... Uh, ha, 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 ha. There's only six chains? Where are the other two? Were they on the ground or something, maybe? I don't know. Small details. It doesn't matter. The aura statue is so cool! The Hul Grand's Cathedral. It's so cool. Pyros, Or Pyros now in his third incarnation. So cool. I love that he has his own background music. I wonder if Hiseo also got to hear the background music. Like, if that's just a thing that Pyrrhos has as a hypothetical employee of CC Corporation. Hey, Gaspard! Gaspard! Huh? <laughs> oh, it's you, Haseo! <laughs> um, what's up? What's up with you? You don't look so good. I... I'm fine. I'm pretty much the same as always. Yeah, convincing. All right, then. I've got to fight at the arena to raise my rank. Seo, you have absolutely no sense of empathy, do you? Just... Uh... Uh... Um, okay. Hey, one half. Uh... We probably need to go level up a little bit, too. I'm, we're not, uh... Okay. Let us go fight in the arena. Coon and Pi, we rarely get a chance to interact with you two. Hmm. Pyrrhos the Third, the Lord Partisan, level 15. Welcome aboard. Oh, he of fair eyes, understood. Pyrrhos the Third, the slow Doberman, pledges to fight by your side until his life expires. And Atalie. Thank you for the party invitation. I'll be right there, so please wait for me. Pyrrhus, do you have any good stuff? Gosh, you're very shiny. He of fair eyes, it seems you and I have much in common. We must shout our love to all in the world. The world needs love. Yes, this world is full of light. You are ridiculous as ever, and I love it. Uh, what on earth do you have equipped? Gosh, he, like, even his picture, everything. Oh, Pyrrhus, you are still the exact same goofball that you were in R1. Uh, level 15 Lance, the Golden Spear. He has a rough shell, level 10. And, uh, level 15 accessories. So he doesn't have any... Oh, his Lance is unique. That is Pyrrhus' weapon. We're not going to be able to change it or interact with it in any way. Uh, whoops, I meant to customize. So he doesn't have any materials to slot in anything. So we could get him something. Let's go check the... Actually. Air Raid. 
thrust upwards and thorn dance break through the enemy's defense by force we're going to try him out in an arena fight or two we'll see how it goes um oh yeah red bike yes run people over ha ha i am the terror of death fear me oh yeah did we sell stuff do we have money we have a lot of money. Wow, Great Comet Dust sold for a lot. Um, I don't really have a lot to put up for sale right now because we haven't been out grinding any <laughs> any areas, any like actual real stuff. Um, I don't even know what I'd want to give. Oh, wow. Increase enemy item drop rate by 10%. Holy moly, I want that. Oh, we have no coupons. Sure. Uh, I actually don't want that equipped right now. Yeah, I like that a little bit better. But that's a really cool thing to have, just to hold on to. Um, so we can't put anything on Pyrrhus' weapon. He seems to be all in on fire. Because of the fire idol and presumably because of his weapon. Yeah, fire and light. Uh, we could give him something for his armor. I don't even know. I don't even know if there's anything that is that useful at this point. Yeah, I'm not going to worry about it. If we're having trouble in the arena fights and we do actually need some gear and, and levels and stuff like that, I mean, honestly, I think levels will matter more first and foremost, but if, like, we're getting poisoned a lot in the arena or something, then yeah, we'll come back and we'll deal with that. For now, though, let us go over to the other server. Uh, town... Warring City Lumina Cloth. I like the names of the cities in these games. Um, I'm not going to mess with Pyrrhus' gear at all. We will save, though, real quick. Oh no, a peek behind the scenes. You can see all my rolling saves. Oh no, quick, hide it. Don't let anybody see. Quickly ride our bike up the stairs to the arena counter. Good job, Haseo. Um, yeah, we'll do the random survival battle. We don't get to choose who we're fighting. It's going to be random. And so it's going to be a lot of, like, small increases of WP, but we'll get more as we do more consecutive fights. That's literally the whole mechanic here. So we should be able to grind through a bunch of these without too much trouble because we are very strong. Time for the festivities to begin! It's a bunch of level 13 enemies. You calling us low-ranking cubs? Hey! More like a sleeping lion hungry for its first kill! Oh, look at Pyrrhos. Let your beastly instincts run wild! He is very shiny and sparkly and gold. Fight's dirty! Nice compliment! While they're asleep, or while they're awake, they think of nothing other than the slaughter! This is their paradise! I think eventually the announcer does change the things that he says. Just look at them, folks! Oh. Rip the opponent in half. Look at the size of Pyrrhus' drill lance land? thing. That's awesome. Yeah, I think the announcer says different things eventually, but for now it's just going to be a lot of the same old stuff. Oh, Rangeki. Look at that. Yeah, Hongeki, counterattack and I hit both of them. Oh my gosh, I'm so strong. Well done, Haseo. 
And Pyrrhus. Pyrrhus is in there helping out. Hey, look at that. Two whole experience. <laughs> 16 more for the Rengeki. Okay. So the quicker we defeat the enemies, the more HP and SP we recover at the end of the fight, and then we just go into the next one. So instead of only 16, same levels of people, roughly, but they're worth 22 SP. So we're just going to grind through a bunch of these. Yeah, uh, say so Rengeki, get the leader. Oh, thank you, Pyros. Look at that. Also, I wanted to check my um, like weapon levels since we were told that we get more of that in the arena. Also, I didn't realize Adelie was only level 13. I thought she was 15-ish like the rest of us. Wow, Pyros, you have no regard for your SP at all. I, I love it. <laughs> He's just going nuts. Um, status. Oh, you're set to rage. Well, that's why you're burning through your SP. Got it. Um, no strategy. Status. Level five with the lance. He is the leader of Project GU. Moon Tree is rank ten. They're a shiny golden guild. We're only a rank one guild. Canard. Um, Haseo's level two and a third-ish, maybe, with the dual swords. So it's going to be a little while before we get any new abilities. I would love to get some new abilities. We only have the one right now. Other Mage is the leader. That's interesting. Okay. Did we kill their other person? Oh, Pyrrhus just took him out on his own. Wow. Well done, Pyrrhus. Little bit of recovery. Wow. Yeah, we're killing these things quickly enough that Pyrrhus is getting a crap ton of SP back. Ooh. Okay, level 15. They're on our own level. Oisan, Psyche, and Chief Gemi. Two Edge Punishers and a Shadow Warlock. Level 15, the Yige Workers. They're also only beginners. I wish I could have named our team, because Team Haseo is just... Ugh. That is a giant freaking sword. Come on, Rengeki. Yes, I love it. Kill the warlock. Or get in there with another Rengeki. Ooh, that hurts. Oh, wow, we took out the other ones. I think that was uh, Adelie who took out the other two. Ooh, we do have a full um, awakening. Does that carry over between the fights? I don't think it does. I don't know. I haven't been paying attention. We got a double Rengeki there, though. Adelie might actually level up from all this. That's exciting. I'm glad none of our opponents has gone after Adelie because of you. Starring Divorce Note. That's... Hmm. 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 I don't know how I feel about that. That's a name and a half. Okay, so our awakenings don't carry over. Oh my gosh, having two mages sucks. You know what doesn't suck? Ringekis. 
I can't wait until we fight Endrance. That's going to be so awesome. Hey, look at that. All of our fights. <laughs> Counterattack, only one. We got an E rank on that. I forgot that we got ranked. That's pretty good, though. We got a B rank. We got 161 WP and 150 gil. Hey, we went from rank 500 to 320. Only need to do that. What, like eight more times or something? Um, by the way, oh, it's not all Kate. It's Akatsuki that's a number one. I was mistaken. I think that is Alcade, though. I think that's her team. Um, by the way, everybody else is going up a little bit. So they were 650 or something, the people at the bottom. Now 723 is the lowest. So we are, like, they're also climbing the ranks. Hey, we now have a bronze arena rank. We got a mantis shell, a turtle shell, and a turtle crest. I think turtle shell is physical damage reduction, and turtle crest is magic reduction. Let's do another... Oh. Let's do another one! Let me, we get to choose who we fight against. I mean, doing one fight and getting 100 WP seems pretty good. Fatty Tuna, AK-47, and non-B. Not gonna lose. Yeah, we'll go after them. They're a little tough. They're a little tough. Now that we're bronze, the announcer might have a different thing to say to us because we're no longer beginners. I'm actually really excited. Now is the time for the festivities to begin! You calling us low-ranking cubs? Nope. Hey! More like a sleeping lion hungry for its first kill! Nope, same old thing. Let your beastly instincts run wild! Oh, we are gonna run wild. It's gonna be awesome. Fight's dirty! Nice cup! Okay, skipping that. Um, I am a bit worried about Adelie. We do actually need to go gain some levels here. Oh yes, finish off the healer. Or just hurt the healer a bunch. Get her before she can heal! Fatty Tuna, no! Or, or him. It could be him. It could be a guy. You never know. Uh, where's the other person? Oh, the gunner. Yeah, Hongeki. Yes. <laughs> I love it. It's kind of tough, though, when you can't see the other person. Like, camera management is actually really important here. Yes. <laughs> oh, the counterattacks are real. Here we go. Demon Awakening. Let's do this. Here it comes. Safety release. Safety release. Oh, yeah, we're doing a spellcasting one. Oh, I forgot that we had that. I thought that I swapped back. It doesn't matter. That was great. Look at that. Oh, we are so strong. 93 more. Wowza. Points. Ooh, make that 113. Rank 239. We're working our way up. Hey, we're silver ranked. We get a Spin Rasetu and a Red Sunstone. Red Sunstone, what does that do? Um, customize Haseo, Fire Koga. Oh, the Mantis Nail would be critical hit rate? Ooh, that sounds great. Turtle Shell, physical damage. Uh, Turtle Crest is magic damage. That's what I thought. What was the other thing that we got? Oh, Red Sunstone. Art SP consumption is reduced. So we have another one of those now. So we could give one of those to... I mean, I could give one to Pyros. We could give one to Syllabus. Something like that. Hmm. There are lots of options. Hey, you! Oh, what is this? What do you want, <laughs> oh, old man? Oh yes. <laughs> you know, 
You've got a lot of spirit. I love this guy. I was watching your match. Well, gee, thanks. What are you, a fan? Yeah, right, in your dreams. Huh? You still don't understand the difference between area and arena battles, do you? You're not using your skills, kid. And above all, you're not cooperating with your companions. Who the hell are you? Are you trying to pick a fight or something? Listen, you've been able to win up until now with sheer momentum, but high-ranked fights won't be so kind. If you want to keep winning, then you need the advice of someone who's been there. I'm doing well enough. Oh-ho! If you really think you're doing well enough, then come and show me just how well you're doing. Go complete the mission at the area word Delta Lazy Advices Exile right now. If you can complete that mission, then I'll recognize your ability. Why would I care about that? Hey, it's up to you to do it or not. If you're not up to it, run away with your tail between your legs. Shoo! <laughs> Run away? Don't you look down on me! I'll clear that area like it's nothing! Now you've done it, kid. Ever hear of the saying, a man never goes back on his word? I'll show you what I can do. I'll breeze through that damn mission. Okay, lazy advice is exile. <laughs> on terrorists. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love it. Haseo, you are so ignorant of, like, the inner politics of the world. He has no idea the importance of the character that he's talking to. Um, uh, You know what? Let's just log out. We do need to level up our beloved cleric, Atali. She needs to... Just, I'm, I'm worried about her. So far, nobody's really been going after her, but... Uh, I'm just a little concerned. Um, forums should just have a response to what I posted about Gaspard being a high ranker in Crimson Versus. So Gaspard, oh, I'm getting kind of embarrassed here. And then responding to what I said, oh, of course, you bet. I promise you and me are going to battle for sure. So that's fun. Look at that. Say, look, at, look at you being uh, in friendly competition with Gaspard. Oh my gosh, that entrance painting. Oh, Master N. Uh, meanwhile, back in our email here, we have Pyrrhus III, what he wants. Paid vacation! During his vacation, upgrade Pyrrhus III. Ah ha 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 I love Pyrrhus. Oh, so good. Best character ever. Okay, Atali. Oh, and she has another mission. <sighs> this time, it's definitely okay. Hello, Haseo. When I told Sakaki that I was going to participate in the arena, he gave me these area words. They're supposed to lead to places where you can gain a lot of experience. Delta Halberd Black Bodhi Tree. Why don't we invite Syllabus and go level up? Please invite me whenever it's convenient for you. Sincerely, Atali. We'll probably go do that, just, you know, because it's Atali. He of Fair Eyes from Pyrrhus III. All right. Good Grief, Pyrrhus, you are the most ridiculous looking character ever. Oh, I am terribly sorry for my earlier atrocity. Let us fight together as comrades in our search for triage. Damaging the graphics is a crime against the very gods themselves. I will never let him get away with it. How much do you know about triage? Or are you really a graphics artist for CC Corp? Yeah, we'll send that. I don't know if it matters too much. And, uh... Sound? I don't remember what we were talking to Atlee about. We can always pop back in and send another reply. Um... What on earth were we talking about? I really wish there was a better way to filter all this stuff. Oh, Endrance on the tree with the cat, and he was playing with, like, the swirling black goo. 
Did we know at the time that that was Ida? I don't remember. But Endrance was fiddling with it, and Adelie hear, heard a weird sound from his direction. And so we asked, what What do you mean? What, what are you talking about? And Adelie says, I'm not quite sure myself. Sometimes I can hear, or rather my headset can hear sounds. Sounds that other people around me can't seem to hear. It sounds like a ghost story, doesn't it? I've talked to Sakaki about this too. Oh yeah, by the way, congratulations on your latest arena victory! Congratulations, but you fought in it too. Or you did well. You look good out there. Yeah, yeah, Haseo, be nice. Try to make up for all the horrible, just mean things that you've said to Adley. Oh, Haseo, you got a long way to go. Um, anyway, we have a, <laughs> we have a mission from Antares, <laughs> which is when, when yeah. <laughs> He's like a PvP, or no, sorry, not a PvP. Well, I mean, I guess PvP. He's an arena legend. He's like, he is like a, a very famous character. He's not quite entrance levels of famous, but other people in the world would recognize him instantly. And the fact that just Haseo gets all huffy and is like, screw off, old man. I think that's hilarious. Um, but Haseo's like that with everyone. So yeah, we have that mission. We have Atelie's mission. She wants to go level up, so we may as well do that. Um, I generally just need to go get more stuff. Like we need more items. We need we need things that we can trade and sell and all that stuff. The guild shop right now is currently empty. Um, oh, there's a whole weird like guild alchemy thing that Syllabus was telling us about that we should go check out as well. We got a lot of stuff to do. We got a lot of stuff to do. Um, but we're, we'll do something, some of it, I guess, next time. Thank you all for joining me, and may the grace of the Twilight Dragon be with you. <laughs>